It has been a year since the collapse of the Capital Theatre Association put the building's future in limbo. But now the rumours are confirmed. A news conference brought together staff and politicians from Chatham-Kent and staff from St. Clair College to announce a deal is in place and ownership will change. College President Dr. John Strasser says it will give theatre students an opportunity for training and a new program. We would like to have a marquee program anchored in Chatham that, we, that we're doing only in Chatham. And it's, it's the opinion of all of the folks in, in, in St. Clair College that a school of dance is, is, is what we should look at first. Still a lot of questions. Mayor Randy Hope says no money changes hands. The funds Chatham-Kent put into the theatre become an investment in the college. The theatre is no longer a municipal expense, however, and the annex is not included. It's still tied up in legal issues. Strasser says the change happens at once. In the meantime, we will be bringing some of our students here that are in theatre arts, that are in uh, entertainment technology, to, to perform on stage here, uh, to help with sound, lights, pyro, whatever has to be done for some of the shows. All that will occur immediately. Strasser says the students and staff will help the economy of downtown Chatham. The shows that are booked will go ahead, and then the college plans to book some more. He's confident that bringing the theater's future into better focus will be a strong financial move. Simon Crouch, Blackburn News. <laughs>